Then what you can do is actually take your thumb, hold the eye closed with the eyelashes, and come back to the eye corners. So you can see what that does. It might take a couple tries here. So we'll go back to that, going right back, holding the eyelashes down to the eye corner. So you can see there how we're holding the eyelashes down. She's got her eyes closed, scissoring in the front all the way to the eye corner. And let's see what we've got on the front on this side. The clients like to see their expressive little eyes. Now I'm going to do the other side. I first have to get some of the longer hair out of the way here at her eyes. I can do this better without holding the eyelashes down and then to fine tune it I'll hold them out of the way. So I'm going to use my thumb as such. Okay, see how I've got that holding her eyelashes down Come in here. And her eye is closed. I'm holding our eyelashes and I'm going to get right up to the corners, the outside corner. There. Come here. You're a good girl, Molly. She's a very good girl. So, okay. Now you can see her beautiful little eyelashes and her eyes. So now what I'm going to do is I just want to trim a little bit off the front. And I want to do this before I go to the sides so that I can see. Um, how closely I want to get on the sides. So I'm going to go ahead and use a thinning shear here, a fine thinning shear, and come up and just take off some of this coat in the front. And I'm going to want to build this up. I don't want to take any length off the top. So I'm just softening this front part. So I can see how far back I want to come to do the sides. 